And so we are going to Italy today. I happen to be Italian. My last name is Trevisano. And uh, so I'm happy to be moving, uh, walking you through some Italian wine. So we have our map here of Italy. And let's see, I think you can see my mouse, if I'm not mistaken. And so we're going to cover two regions today. We're going up here to the Veneto to talk about Valpolicella. And then, of course, I can't talk about Italy without going to Tuscany. So we're going to do some Chiantis from Tuscany as well. So why Italy? Why do we talk about Italy so much? Because it's very significant uh, in our world. It is the number one pr uh, producing wine um, in the world, which is great. And it's also the number three war, uh, country in consumption. And when you think about that, the, you know, the size, you know, U.S. is number one, but don't let that fool you considering, you know, we're probably five times the size of Italy. So uh, when you think of per capita, uh, we're way behind, but we are, in, we are number one in volume and Italy is number three in volume, but boy, they sure beat us to death in per capita. So we're going to talk about red wine today. So I'll start you off getting you used to putting your fingers on the keyboard because I do have a few little pop quiz questions for you. So uh, question, how much of Italy's wine production is red wine? Is it 70%, 43%, 57%, or 64%? So what do you guys think? Type, type in your best guess here. 70%, 43%, 57%, or 64%. All right, this is the time for our viewers to be a little bit interactive and, and put your guesses into the uh, into the chat box. Yep. Oh, we have somebody else joining from Italy. Yeah, that's nice great. To, nice to see you. Okay, okay. so we have some ans answers yeah. coming in here. 64, 57. Yeah. So far, it looks like 64 is the guess. Um, yeah. 70 is another one. So Kimberly yeah. says 70, uh, Leo says 57, Laura says 64, Carolyn says 64, yeah. uh, Andra, uh, Andras says 57. So okay. what is Well, it? you know, Christian, yesterday, uh, we had a little problem, yes, or not yesterday, Monday, when we did our trivia, I underestimated my audience, <laughs> and I think everybody got 100% on my quiz. Uh, but today, I think I got them right where I want them. <laughs> So actually, you'd be shocked to know, I was quite surprised that Italian production is really more white. But when you think about it, so this is our chart, and of course, the red bars are red and the yellow bars represent white. And we are, it is really offset, the white wine versus red wine production by the Veneto. And you see that here in this first blue box that I put up there for you. So in the Veneto, what are the two most popular wines that we know of, the most high volume wines coming out of the Veneto? Um, would be Galera grape for Prosecco and Pinot Grigio. And that's a lot of volume in Italy. So that really eats up the clock pretty good for us. So, um, now the Veneto, the red wines there are things like Valpolicella. And then you look at Toscana, which I also outlined in blue for you. Now that might be what some of you were thinking when you were choosing 70%, because in Tuscany, 70% of the wines coming there, maybe even more are red. So all all over Italy, we do because of Prosecco and Pinot Grigio, it is really only 43% in volume. 